You know, the thing about Super Size Me is that he was not trying to be a good person when he did Super Size Me. You know? He wasn't trying to be. Do you think that when I'm doing Bulb Kurt, do you think I'm trying to be a good person? Do you think I want to go door to door and knock for your business, Daybreak your Roofing food, Company? Use your food, dude. Can I use your company in my film? Access? Can I use the name of Daybreak Roofing in my film? So let me do all the art. Okay. Okay, you could do the cover art, you can do some cartoons if we use that, non-motion picture stills, I'll let you do all that shit. I, actually, you know what? You are now, and I got this on videotape, hello, you are now the artistic advisor and I would say... I want to be the director and producer. Ah, no, no, you, you can be the producer and you can be the artistic producer. I, I don't even know what you fucking call him anymore, dude. You would be the artistic, artistic the chief. Producer, and you you would be the design artist. You would be... No, I want to be the artistic producer. Why don't you just be the fucking producer? I mean, they make more decisions than the artist anyway. You know? The, the producer's gonna make all the final decisions. If you produce it, you're not in charge of finding the money, Kurt. If you produce it, you're in charge of making it happen, dude. And if that requires money, then that's what it requires. But a producer is in charge of making it happen. Let me tell you what a producer is, okay? If we do it, producer, right here, okay? You've got, the first of all, what it sounds like. Okay, it sounds like something. It sounds like... Producer. Okay, it sounds like producer, okay? This is a person who produces, a person who creates economic value. A producer has goods and services, okay? That could be your art, okay? Part of the production could be your art and your choices that you make as a businessman for Daybreak, okay? Daybreak could produce this film. And, am I, and, and do I want to sign you up a house tomorrow? Yeah! I'm not against it, dude. I want to. Do I have the fucking, like... Do I have that part in my mind that wants to w me to wake up an extra hour earlier and do it? No. Why? Because I'm depressed. Why? Because I lost my life. My wife. You know? I'm just trying to hang in there the best I can. I'm giving you a way out. You're giving me a way out and I don't want the way out. I want the way in to my chosen life. I want to have a rightful place like any man. Just work 20 hours a week. No. Fuck your 20. I want you to work another 80 for me, dude. Does that make any sense? Climb on the roof. I want you to use Bulb Climb on the roof. as a way to save John Bloodworth. Carry the ladder to the roof side and extend it. This is about John making his own film about his divorce. This is about me making my own film about my divorce and that is my decision to deal. That is my response. And you know what? It's wrong. It's bad. It's the wrong way to go. And the reason why I'm going that way is because I'm choosing to. Okay, I'm choosing to go the wrong way. And if you want to go that wrong way with me, I want to tell you that this is the wrong way, Kurt. This is the wrong way. This is the plot against God. You are going to suffer by going this way with me. And if you want to suffer... Follow me. If you want to feel good and choose the natural way, let's sell roofs and do daybreak roofing because that's natural, man. It's right under the day. It's right under the sun. It's natural. But if you want grace, follow Bulb. And you shall have grace. Or do you want the natural chosen? I want the grace, dude. You want the grace? Then you got to sell Bulb. You got to find a way to find the money to come up with Bulb so John Blundworth can live. Okay, that's what I wanted to hear.